Hello, this is Nick. This is Nick995. For this video, this is Metal Gear Solid 5 walkthrough. It's a new walkthrough I'm doing, right? So sorry for the blurry screen, but it's part of the cutscene. It's a cutscene, so so and uh, if you're watching this comment down below, please share, subscribe, like the video. Long, long time ago. As it's one of the weirdest openings to a game. You're gonna see it's, it's long, it's very long. I'm gonna have to skip some of it. You never lost control. So basically, what happened? This guy's been in a coma for nine years, right? So, if you guys know Mel Gear Solid, you guys know Snake being the main character, right? Snake is the main character. What I should have done done was I did a walkthrough of. Uh, uh, I'm probably gonna do a walkthrough of. Metal Gear Solid Ground Zero first, it's quick, it's a quick little thing, you know, it's quick, and then, uh, 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 and then I'll, uh, I'll do this. It's weird, it's very weird, you know, Hideo, uh, Hideo, uh, Kojima's, uh, Cutscenes, but the cutscenes are so well done. They're gonna see they're such uh, they did a very good job on the cutscenes. Yeah, I know. Everything is getting clearer and clearer and clearer. Right? I, I mean, music is so good. The music and the Listen. scene. Even though it's not really a scene because you can't really see much of anything. It goes so well together. But then now you're going to see. I already cut out my music. I should cut out my music. Damn. I hate that. Anyways. So yeah, we're going into our next level. So it's going to be in and out, right? They're going to go into through phases of cutscenes. I'm going to just keep some of this up. V has come to. <laughs> Yeah, so this is basically the starting menu for um, only the prologue. I remember, I just only the prologue. Let's keep this up. A quiz man. Can you hear me? Are you having difficulty speaking? Can you move your head? And this Just for a uh, if you can hear me. Yeah, for this part, you know, yeah, you just gotta basically uh, do what he says and then yeah, you'll eventually uh progress is gonna ask you a bunch of questions, tell you what's going on. Look up. Please. I was gonna, yeah. I, Very good. How do you feel now? Can you speak? Can't speak. What is your name? When were you born? Can you recall? Imagine you've been in a coma for nine years and the lore L O R E again, you're gonna kinda see how that happened. Like I'm gonna play the ground zeros. And before this, uh then you're gonna see. Good. Now then. Please try to relax. There is plenty of time. 
I need to tell you something. Please listen and try not to panic. You've been in a so this is busy the part where quite some time. Yes, uh, yes, I know. I don't tell you about the coma. To know how long. My camera. I'm, I'm using my camera was slanted stuck it. Yeah, and you're busy freaking out. You know, like, what? I've been a. What? Come down. Come down. Try not to panic. Wait a second. Try not to panic. You'll be all right. Damn. Just rest. How do you feel? Basically, yeah, uh, time is yeah, uh, and then so you're like going in and out. So you're going in and out. It's been one week since you came to. Now let's try get you out of that bed. Nurse. Don't worry. You've lost some strength, but we've been maintaining your muscle mass through massages, CPM therapy, and EMS. I believe he's gonna give you like a mirror. He's gonna give you a mirror. No. They're gonna I get to see to the character. Something to you, but you must not be alive. Nine years ago, you were injured. In an explosion. Upon examination, we discovered 108 foreign bodies embedded within. In addition to shrapnel, we also found fragments of human bone and human teeth. Most of it was removed, but some of the fragments still remain. They are located near. Ah, so this is part the part, part where and in your skull. They tell you about the injury. Look at this. The, the fragments are lodged deep within your cerebral cortex. Uh, frontal lobe. Oh no. We couldn't give you an MRI. The metal, you see. But even if we were to extract it. You would most likely suffer a brain hemorrhage. Mental and physical impairment are unavoidable. However, your current status is not life threatening. One more thing this X ray is on your upper body. You better look now. Best to understand your situation sooner than later. It's basically freaking the old that I'm going I know through it's this year. You know, a lot of uh, look down. It's best to see with your lot, you know, eyes. Uh, they're be brave. I'm um, uncovering uh, like a lot uh, at once, you know. Yeah, now you realize you have one hand. Uh, no, so come on. Try to calm down. Calm down. Calm down. It's gonna be okay. If you know, yeah. Yes. So trying to you know, strain you, Calm as the leaves and all that. Yes. Yes. Yeah. And then two weeks. Two weeks after we uh, weekend. Two weeks. For some reason, my camera was up. It's true. There are those who wish you would never woken up. Are they being late? You should be dead. Yeah, but you're yes, not. Yes, yes. The wheels are in motion. Your enemies are everywhere. We must alter your appearance immediately. Otherwise, I fear you won't leave this place alive. It's a wide open I'm basically the character customization so part of it. Cause to take care of it. And it's gonna end soon. The video's gonna end soon, so. Again, please uh, uh, comment down below. This is going to be a customization part which I'm going to skip. So, our uh, next part is going to be. I'm going to change your appearance. We have no other choice. 
What do you look like? So that's snake, however? basically. That's what snake would look like. If you guys know Snake being like the main character in Metal Gear Solid. So yeah, this is basically where it ends. Please share, subscribe, a comment down below. I thank you.